The front, the front end really ought to be rebuilt. It just, well, it looks like it's still got all the original floorboards in it. Oh, it, it, I'm sure everything's original. I mean, this thing, guy, this thing is stupid it's, solid. It looks to me like it needs a really good bath, and I'm sure, like the the original floor color is probably on top of the transmission. If you clean it off, the red oxide would come out, and you could whoever does it could color match all of that. But I mean, this thing, this still got the original floorboards in it. Oh, oh I mean, no. you can tell that it's it, never, it it's never had any body work on it. It, it done to this car at all and this was your uncle's car no no this was this was my godparents car wayne and okay. elsie pearl I, I couldn't, couldn't figure out what yeah that was my godparents car and then they sold it to my mom and dad and then my mom and dad traded it back to wayne for an for a, a 73 mercury um, Mon Monterey. Well, I can Montego. tell you who got the better end of that deal. And <laughs> then Wayne always knew that I loved this car. And that was in 1974. And I I didn't have any money. I was moved up here. I was work, making $3.05 an hour. Had an apartment to pay for and a, and a house or a Motorcycle and a car payment. So, you know how that went. I didn't have a dime to my name. I think I was one year old in 1974. And he took, uh, he told me he'd take $200 for it and I could pay him $10 a month. <laughs> so, I said I couldn't pass that up. And then, then I wound up, I worked a whole, did a whole bunch of work for him, cutting trees down after a storm about six months later and uh he gave me the title to it well there you he go said, you're paid in full well, i mean you can tell it's it's an now, original the underside were, the brakes were all the brakes the hoses the wheel cylinder everything was done redone when i when i did that 20 some years ago i wow. would like to watch somebody take a car like this and use that uh Use that. Uh, right here is probably the roughest place on the whole car. Right here, where the guy did the bondo on this bottom edge. But there was no rust there to speak of. Man, this thing is nice. This is a great car. It's actually better than kind of what you described it to me. I mean, this is a nice car. And I'm picky about stuff and i mean the underside is greasy but it's unmolested it's just well, uh, yeah but, course, but i'm sure it had single exhaust no it actually did it really it, it's factor dual wow yeah it's factor dual exhaust Martin, it's still got the carter fuel pump here. on it i restored it last year That's an 81, 1100 Suzuki. Motorcycles anymore. I'm glad I lived through that stage of my life. They're pretty. Old Suzuki. Yeah, that's... Did you buy that Sedalia? Uh, no, I bought it when I bought my gas station. Right after I bought my gas station here in town. Nice I and close. It, I bought it in 82. This is an 81. Yeah, see, I had a six-speed Yamaha. 